Hello, my name is Lisa. Thanks for joining me. Our developers' goals in creating this software were to save time, inspire more people to engage with boards, and provide well-organized and ongoing discussions that lead to better decision-making. And because of his vision, it has grown into an easy-to-use, web-based application that improves board communications and meeting productivity. There's no downloading, and it works across all platforms from desktop to smartphone. So let's move on to the Loros homepage. Within Loros, each Strata Council is its own unique group that is made up of Strata Council members and property managers. A great thing about Loros is that Strata managers like yourself can belong to an unlimited number of groups. So now you can manage all of your Strata Council meetings and communications from a single login, ultimately saving you a significant amount of time. As an administrator, you have the ability to adjust voting rights, assign admin access, and submit a title. So we're just getting started and there are a lot of features. To simplify, I thought I'd start with my favorite feature. Discussions. Discussions put an end to the confusing and hard to follow email threads. Here's how it works. Simply click start a discussion. A box pops open for you to add a subject, assign an end date, which is something you can't do with emails, add background notes, create links to the web, and add files. Simply hit submit and you've started a discussion. Like a Facebook feed, you can add a comment and reply to any comments within the feed. Let's say you had a discussion about landscaping in the past and you'd like to link members into that previous discussion. Well, you can do that too. Simply go to search and type in landscaping. Loro's search engine finds all references to landscaping. Select the dropdown to find a link to copy. So discussion solves your email problem, but you're probably wondering about running a meeting in Loros. Let's start an online meeting. You have an option here. You can start a new one by clicking start a meeting, or you can choose one of your templates. If you start a new meeting, you will be asked to fill in a few blanks. I've jumped past the fill in the blank sections to give you an idea of what an agenda looks like. As you can see, I added a purpose, chose a start and end time, uploaded files, and added agenda topics. Each member is then notified with a link to the online agenda. Once the meeting time has started, you can open each topic to add a motion, move in second a motion, vote, or add a comment. Further inside each topic, you'll find extras like add an action, add a poll, and invite guests to comment. Any member has the option to print or create a PDF of the agenda before a meeting, a full transcript during and after a meeting, and minutes when the meeting has ended. So, I've highlighted the basics to get you started. However, I've merely scratched the surface of this easy to use web-based application that improves board communications and meeting productivity. As you've seen, Discussions is an easy to use tool that will lead you to intuitively understand motions, actions, polls, and search functions. We offer a 30-day free trial for all new groups. If you can identify a couple of software savvy staff members, then we'd be happy to provide personalized training. We will also assist you with onboarding the first four to six councils. Of course, we would be looking to identify the most tech savvy councils in your midst first.